Amid rising geopolitical tensions in the Indo-Pacific, several nations have assessed that the risk of conflict is now increasing. Alarm is growing over Chinese belligerents, defense budgets have surged, and long-range strike capabilities are almost universally valued. And now Beijing has hit out at Washington. The Chinese foreign ministry said Beijing firmly opposes the U.S. attempt to deploy a medium-range missile system in the Asia-Pacific region. During a visit to South Korea on Saturday, the U.S. Army Pacific commander said that the Army would soon deploy a new missile launch system that could fire its latest, quote, long-range precision fire, such as the standard missile six interceptor and the maritime strike Tomahawk in the Asia-Pacific. The SM-6 is the U.S. Navy's latest intercept missile designed for extended range anti-air warfare against ballistic missiles with an operational range of more than 240 kilometers. The Tomahawk is a subsonic cruise missile capable of striking a target about 2,500 kilometers from a warship or in a submarine base land attack operation. And according to the Carnegie Endowment for International Peace, the Indo-Pacific region is at the cusp of a new missile age driven by perceptions of rising insecurity. Short to intermediate range surface to surface missile systems are quickly proliferating in the region. Systematic competition between China and the United States and worsening threat perceptions continue to drive substantial investment by nations in a range of missile capabilities. China has territorial disputes with several nations in the region. It has contested Japanese control over the Senkaku Islands and has claimed sovereignty over the South China Sea. The Philippines, Brunei, Malaysia, Taiwan and Vietnam have conflicting claim lines in the South China Sea. Taiwan continues to be an unfinished agenda for Ta China and Beijing's new Beijing and New Delhi relations reached a tipping point in the aftermath of the Galwan incident. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.